Bonjour and welcome to a new unboxing video and today we've got something special. I, I know, I always say that, but this is actually truly special. Uh, it's uh, it's this box. As you can see, it says uh, Starfleet Command United Federation of Planet. It says Star Trek USS Enterprise NCC 1701. And it actually comes from Corgi Toys. Yes, Corgi has decided to do a new version of the USS Enterprise. Actually, there will be two. There's also a uh, uh, an Enterprise D from Star Trek: The Next Generation. But I've received the, uh, the 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 one that they've done for classics. So I sort of thought, well, might as well discover it all together because I haven't seen it yet. So. Uh, this is something that I pre-ordered a while ago. It's just out, uh, so it should be available. I don't know if it's available in store or if you have to order it online. Uh, I know you can order it online because that's why I got it. Um, but I don't know, as it's a limited edition that they're doing, it might be just available online. I, I have absolutely no clue. You would have to check that, I'm afraid. So so first of all, we're going to, to check, of course, the box. So the box is actually be it's a beautiful box uh, with like this silver foil uh, logo for uh, Starfleet Command, which is a classic Starfleet Command logo. It does say that if you scan this, you can view the model in augmented reality on iOS, which I think is a fun little feature. On the side, you do have the USS Enterprise 1701 uh, and it, as you can see it's also in silver foil you do have a Corgi logo you have absolutely nothing here Corgi logo here and in the back you've got all the useless information for us but that's actually mandatory because it's all the, the legal stuff I'm just checking uh, so it's a die-cast model for the adult collector, they say. And it's not suitable for children under 14 years old. Well, it's okay because I'm more than 14 years old. So, so we're going to open that and um, I have absolutely no clue what it's like. I, I haven't seen it yet. Uh, so I'll be discovering this at the same time as you do. And I'm actually quite excited about it. And I hope it's actually not damaged because from time to time you can have new stuff arriving and it's been broken for whatever reason i mean there's it's very rare that it happens but it can happen from time to time and it's, it's a bit annoying when it's the case but uh, well i'm going to hope it's not the case so we do have the box here let's see how it oh so basically you do have this oh that's very very nice so here you go this is the inside of the box that's actually a very, very nice box inside. Um, quite a deluxe thing. So it does say the legendary fleet uh, flagship of the golden age of interstellar discovery, USS Enterprise, blah, blah, blah. Constitution class. It does have some L cars, even though they are uh, very, very uh, classic L cars. I would say not the next generation. And you do have this part here with the ship. So we're going to open it and see what that ship looks like. Uh, Corgi usually is pretty good at doing their ship, uh, their, their ships and stuff. Uh, so I have absolutely no doubt it's going to be a great model. So I'm going, just going to, that's a quite a, a heavy one. Um, let me see, I always check under the tray. So this is the, uh, the, the, the stand, and so it's a normal, plastic stand as you can see there's nothing really special but here is the USS Enterprise it feels really great because it feels heavy like a die cast should be uh, and it's actually very 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 nice I, I do like it there's lots of little details as you can see on the back well of course there's not that much detail on the original uh, ship but I mean it's really very nicely done so here is the top view then you can see the bottom view so you do have the USS Enterprise uh, writing you do have some uh, of those uh, uh, done really really good job and this is the side and the other side it's really very 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 nice I, I do really like it and we're going to see if it holds on 
it's done because that's often the big question so here it is on it's done it it's it looks really cool i i'm actually very very nicely surprised by it because I, I didn't know what to expect i haven't bought a corgi toy in years and, and this is definitely uh, a great great version of the uss enterprise i mean it's it's really cool i'm just puzzled about one thing here let me see yeah that's interesting that the the plug uh i don't know if you can see but just by putting the ship on the plug i actually rubbed the paint on there which is a bit of a shame but it's okay it will be inside anyway and uh, it just means that the the at least the the stand is secure let's see if it it is balanced yep it is balanced as well so that's really cool so here you go so that's the new uh uss enterprise NCC 1701, so the classic Enterprise, Kirk's Enterprise from the classic series. It's just out from uh, uh, Corgi Toy and uh, it's completely die cast except for the, the base that's uh, plastic. And it's really very, very cool. I, I really, I'm, I'm actually really nicely surprised by it it's very 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 nice toy very very nice collectible so here you go it's a short uh, video for once but i thought you would want to see that and hopefully i'll be able to do another unboxing for the uh, enterprise d when it's out which should be out because i think it's out as well i just haven't received it yet so it may be a bit delayed so maybe in a few days maybe next week i will do the um uss enterprise d uh, in the same collection so it's available from corgi check on the website i'm sure they sell worldwide as well so it's in the uk of course though, because corgi is a british company and uh and that's really cool i really like it bye